Girl, I was not expecting this. Wait a minute. Let me cut my phone, my TV off. I'm here. I have good how lighting. Not, how you not expecting it and you call me? Because there'd be so many people on this thing, girl. <laughs> Wasn't expecting. Okay. Are you ready? Yep. What's your name, babe? Lou. From Nashville. Lou, where are you calling from? Nashville, Tennessee. Nashville, Tennessee. How old are you? 34. 34. What you do for a living? I work at a Fortune 500 company. Okay. Okay. Do you have any kids? One. She's 18. 18. Have you ever been married? No. What's your zodiac sign? <laughs> what happened? <laughs> they were saying I need to back up. Move back from the okay. camera. Is this okay? This is good. What's your zodiac sign? Pisces, 21990. Okay. So we got Lou. Your name is Lou? Yes. Short for... Lou? What, honey? It's short for Lou Sean. Okay. Lou, Nashville, Tennessee, 34 years old, Pisces. She works for a Fortune 500 company. Mom to an 18-year-old. Never yeah. married. Right? Have you been married? No. Never married. What kind of man are you looking for, girl? I'm looking for a, a guy with good character. No narcissistic guys. Uh, honestly, I don't even really care how the guy looks, to be honest. Um, as long as I can kiss him, I think we good. As long as he's not fat, fat, I think we'll be okay. Um, I'm at the age now that I don't really care about looks anymore because it just none of that works for me it's all about the inside so so i'm gonna make sure i understand as long as you can kiss him and as long as he's not fat fat i will entertain him i will see, see how things go but i'm not i, I just want to see how things go with a person he doesn't have fine, fine. Question. What? What? What's that? What's the definition of fat fat? Okay, like overweight, bigger than myself. So if you fat, like, fat. So, 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 so there's fat, and then there's fat fat. Okay, if you are over two hundred pounds, I don't think you and I will fit. Okay. That's what it is. Let's do the Kendra I, I'm, I'm working on losing weight for myself. Let's do the Kendra Cam. Yeah. So, yeah, let's do the Kendra Cam. Okay. Okay. I okay. have lost, I've lost about seven pounds within the last three months working on my skin. My, my nails are real. These are mine. My hair real. I'm natural, which nothing is wrong with not being natural. I like to dress up and look cute, wear the lashes and stuff too. Okay, okay, okay. Hair done, nails done, everything big. Hair done, nails done, everything big. You fancy, huh? Not necessarily. I just take care of me. I love myself. That's all. Do you give me your deal breakers? Uh, a deal a deal breaker for me is breath. I was talking to somebody, his breath smelled so bad that I got nauseous every single time he spoke. I can't deal with it. I have to, I would put peppermints in my mouth or halls in my mouth to not smell his breath. I cannot deal with bad breath. Everybody say they can't deal with life. That's a bad breath. If you are not spiritually in tune with God, I'm not trying to teach you about them. I'm not trying to do none of that. You going to church mm -mm. on Sunday? Every, every Sunday I go to church. I'm going to church tomorrow, actually. I got a volunteer. Oh, 
she up in there. She's about the Lord for real. I'm okay. not a any perfect. Other deal, any other deal breakers? Someone who does not have a family. If you don't have, have I mean, I can understand if you are a single, like for instance, my daughter, she's the only child. So she don't have like a, she wouldn't have a lot unless she make, produce a lot. But I would love love or guy who has a mama that's still living a dad i want to experience family life okay um yeah. now you got the looks early do you want to break it down further the looks because you said you just said not fat fat mm -hmm. and as long as you can kiss them yeah like like if i'm physically like if i'm physically attracted to your mouth because I'm actually looking at you and speaking with you. I can see myself like kissing you. Yeah. Um, I don't, the looks, I done dated so many type of guys in my life. Be it fat. I don't have time to be lifting you up to suck you. I don't want that on your thing on my head. Wait, say that word again? Stomach on my head, like. I don't want that anymore. Why like, I don't want to. I want to be on your head. Because you, I'm sorry. My phone keeps dropping. I have a hardwood table and I don't have a stand right here. Why would a stomach be uh, on your head? Like, if I'm, I, if I'm on my knees sucking you, I don't want that. Like, mm, mm. but you're not small no i'm not small but i don't really want to be small i'm gonna i'm not gonna ever be small i don't really want to be small i'm who god created me to be and that's thick but i'm not i'm while i'm thick i'm gonna be healthy sorry i just, I was need, a just, moment. I just need a moment to get over the explanation of why his stomach can't be on your head i, I'm, I don't want that Everybody has their own way of how they want to date. What, what, or, kind of, what kind of what, what kind of church you go to? What kind of church? My the, what kind of church you go to? It doesn't matter about the church that I go to. I, the, I, I like. I'm just interested in the, to, the, the the church that you go to every day. Yeah, I go on Sunday. I go on Wednesday mornings for um, prayer. What they teach but, there? What they talk about? What they talk about? What your we church talk, talk about? We, we, what they we talk about? What, the good, what, uh, what the pastor be talking about? He don't. He don't. He don't. He don't, he don't what, what the pastor be talking about? He he be talking about make sure nobody big stomach on your head when you on your knees. That's been a, the pastor ain't never. That has don't the pastor have a cup of that in the sermon? Why would, why would he talk about that? I, I, I've been trying to figure it out. Are you, getting, are you going towards um, judgmental, like me being judgmental? Well, I'm, I'm asking for clarification. That's the difference. Because I, yeah, I, I will say now I will say this out of mm -hmm. your own mouth. You said you want a God fearing man, and then you. Mm -hmm. and that's why I asked you were you a God fearing woman. Mm -hmm. So we just want to. I'm asking for <laughs> clarification, not judgment. From my, from my, from my understanding, from my understanding. Mm -hmm. These are things that churches sometimes, just sometimes, talk about. But I don't know. Maybe your church doesn't. That's why I'm asking. No, I want to be a. I want. I don't want a guy with a big stomach. I mean, you're you're smaller. So when a big person and another big person do it, and if you on top of them, like your stomach touching their stomach, and it make them little noises. I just want to not have that. Okay. We understand. Let the, let, let, let the church say amen. Let's keep going. Um, when was your last relationship? My last relationship was like four years ago. Four years ago. Okay. Yeah. You don't have to answer, but I'm going to ask. When's the last time you was intimate with someone? Mm, probably before my birthday. My birthday is in February. Maybe like a week or two before my birthday. Okay. So three, three, three flaws you have to work on. Oh, three flaws that I have to work on. One flaw is could be well. One flaw is 
the way that I speak sometimes. I work. I need to work on uh, speech, like getting getting it out, getting what I have to say out. Okay. Better. Yeah. Work. yeah. Yes. Work on a speech. Mm -hmm. Anything that. Okay. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Um, sometimes I be saying I be thinking something and it come out totally wrong. Okay. Okay. Fair enough. Did I ask you if the guy got to make a certain amount of money? No, you didn't. And a guy does have not, don't really have to make a certain amount of money, but he got to be able to provide in some type of way. Provide like He got to be, be able to, I'm not going 50, 50 on no rent. That's what I'm not going to do. But if you're paying all of the rent, I'll pay the water bill. I'll do, do something to help out. Um, but I just don't want to pay 50, 50 on rent. I don't want to go half on rent. How much you pay for your rent right now? I pay 1400 for a two bedroom. No, no, I guess I meant, I, I, you're right. Let me ask the question more in the percentage way. How much of the percent of your rent do you pay right now? One hundred percent of my rent. I pay all of my rent by myself. I don't have any help. I don't have any government assistance. I want it sometimes because it's hard. It really is. So okay, just I just want to understand. So you pay a hundred percent of your rent right now. If you meet a man, you would not go half with him. He would have to pay a hundred percent of your rent. Of our rent, yeah. If I'm married, because I want if if we're married, I want to feel that my husband is taking care he's taking care of the family he's doing what he's he's providing he is providing i just don't feel comfortable with going half on the rent i don't like the okay the, so where does your money go while he's paying 100 percent now the rent you used to pay 100 percent for what are you doing mm -hmm. with your money now that you no longer contribute at all to your rent so i'm definitely not going to just be not doing anything like I stated earlier I'm definitely going to contribute to the household the by doing bill. Something. the light bill the light bill. How, the much light light bill. bill how much is your light bill right now honestly Kendra I ain't really I every time I get paid I send money to the light company so I never have to worry about paying it I never open up my light bill I always have a credit always and I so, can prove I don't know, give me a guess, give me a guesstimation of how much a light bill is. Girl, I maybe eighty dollars. I mean, I'm never okay. home. Okay, eighty dollars. Um, okay, so let's just we can use eighty. So right now you pay fourteen hundred for rent and eighty dollars for the light bill. But if you need a man, he got to pay that whole fourteen hundred, and you'll still spend the eighty for the light bill. So what no, you doing with that? I'm, no, I'm pretty sure that everything like if we move in together it's going to be way more expensive than that what? I am not going to have my man having a load on him I'm going to help him you take the load the off the rent the rent should not be a load no if it's two people in the house and you are my man you're going to want to pay the rent you're going to want to make sure that everything is taken care of you're gonna want to, that's the kind of man that i want the one that wants to do these type of things and he's going to be able the man that i want is going to be able to say okay well babe i done done this i done done that what what are we doing for the rest of the month okay honey i paid this bill i got this bill we can go out this week i don't have we don't have any kids i don't want any children i only got one i'm done so you don't make me don't try to coerce me it ain't happening could he have kids already? Yeah. So, so okay. okay. Older children, yeah. Older but. children. So, okay. Have you ever had this man in your whole life? I have. What happened to him? Why are you not with that man still? I was young and I got too spoiled. I messed up a bag. You messed up? I learned a lot from that. Yeah, I was like, he was paying was all your like, bills. He wasn't paying all of my bills, no, but he was doing the things that I needed. Like if I was to say, "Hey, I'm so tired of going to the laundromat," 
next thing you know, I had a whole washer and dryer. You know what I'm saying? So I was just, I just got too full of it and I lost them. And we're still- So cool. we met a man that financially wasn't able to pay 100% of the rent on his own. He's not the man for you. Mm. That's a good question. I, I don't know because he could, no, no, he's not. He's not the man for you. Okay. Okay. I don't so I don't, want to get, I don't want to say, hey, honey, here's my half of the rent. It sounds like, like we roommating. So are you going to be working too? Or are you going to be staying home? Because you don't want any kids, I, no. any more kids. I'm definitely going to work. So your money you're just going to save? No, it's going to be our money. I, uh, it's so if it's your money, why can't it go to the rent? Because I I don't want. I don't want my money going to the rent that your, that my oh. husband is supposed to be paying. But if it's, it's not happening. Okay, so where does your? I'm just really. I'm not. I'm not know if you ever thought I, about this. So oh, where does no, where my money gonna go? It ain't. I don't know. In in our savings account, but I know one thing. I'm not gonna be not having nothing. When my mom got married and she got divorced, she left. She didn't have anything. She had to start all the way over, and that's one thing that I will remember in my mind. To make so, uh, sure I have something for myself, okay, just in that's case. Understandable. That's understandable. So you'll save your money, and you want a man that can spend all of his. I see. Taking... I didn't say that. I didn't say that. Well, you... I didn't say spend you... all of his. Okay. No, well, I said I don't want to go half on the rent. That's all I said. I didn't want to do. Okay. Would you pay for car notes? Yeah. Which okay. I don't have a car note right now. I've been paying my car though my car off but if we were to get a car yeah okay all right fair enough so she's not paying half of the rent and, that's um, it. Actually, i don't have that's all my negotiables without of every, out of all the people i've heard on your channel they be having all this other stuff my non-negotiable is not being overly overweight and i don't want to pay half the rent i be hearing all type of stuff well listen at the end of the day, you can ask for whatever you can receive, right? I mean, you can ask for whatever, right? So words are free. You can say out loud what you desire. The question always is, does the person that is capable of doing that want to do that for you? That's the second part. So have you ever, and that's why I asked you, have you ever had a man that was willing to pay for the rent 100%, but you said you never had that yet? I've I've had situations to where that could possibly happen, but is all of that worth what you have to put out? What you have to give in order to get? No. Okay. Um, did I ask you the three flaws you have to work on? Yep. Okay. Why would a guy be lucky to be with you? Why would a guy be lucky? to be with you a guy a man would be lucky to be with me because i i'm a builder whatever he brings home i'm going to make sure that it multiplies i'm a prayerful woman i have good i have a good heart um, it's just a, a lot of things. For one, I can cook very well. I own a business. Um, you know, my little side hustle that I have going on, I'm always working. I'm always doing something. I'm never idle. My auntie died yesterday and I've been out working today. I work today. Sorry about your um, eyes. Thank you. I'm just, just like, I'm not lazy. I always keep going. I'm always finding something to do. I'm always finding somebody to uplift. Um, I'm over, sometimes I overextend myself too much. And that's why I get hurt because, because I overextend. Not to men, but just people, period. Just the, the giving part of me. The giving part of her. Okay. Mm -hmm. And let's do it. This is Lua. What's the age range you would date? You're 34. 37 and up. Um, two years. Up. Two to three years older than me. I'm, I've never dated anyone my age. Okay. 
Lou, Nashville, Tennessee, 34, Pisces. Um, she is works for a Fortune 500 company. Mom to eight year old, 18 year old, excuse me. She does not want any more children. Um, wants a God fearing man to not have a big stomach. Um, make sure she can kiss you. That's important. And she's not paying half of the rent, no matter what happens. How can the guy reach out to you? Um, crave my vibes. Crave my vibes. C R A V E M Y vibes. V V I B E S. I don't be on Instagram that much. You don't be on Instagram that much. Okay. Mm -mm. All right. Well, make, make sure you have it. She Say said it one more time. <laughs> it's it's crave and my vibes. Just the way it's written. I mean, just the way it's pronounced. Said crave my vibes. Okay. All right. All right. Keep me posted how it goes, baby. And thank you for making me think. You made me think about something. I need to write it down. Well, listen. This is why I ask questions. To be honest. And I know people think I'm, I'm trolling and I'd be funny, but I know y'all don't think about this stuff. Y'all just speak. Y'all just say stuff. You're not the only ones. But a lot of people, not just women, men included, y'all just say things. And then I like to ask you questions that make you think more of what you're saying. So I'm happy yeah. you understood that. I'm happy you understood. Okay, let me think about what this means. Yeah, so, and I'm happy you I, I don't, that. when you grown, you don't you don't think that you're trying to you're trying to have a combative situation. You just made me think about something. So what did I, I think you me think about? I'm wondering. I I I'll, I'll, I'll inbox it to you. Okay. All right. And it is in it, y'all. I'm sorry. It's it's C R A V E. My bad, guys. It's C R A V. There's no E. e. It's C R A V. E. So it's C R A V my vibes. C R A V oh. my vibes. Okay. All right. Thank you. Bye. Baby. Bye.